Hello everyone, it's Elder here. Today I wanted to talk and go over and review the uh, my uh, Willie Peter bag, right, or WP bag, uh, waterproof bag. Uh, it's basically billed as a uh, waterproof clothing bag, and uh, to be honest with you, uh, throughout my tour in the Marines, uh, we used it for everything but uh, laundry. All right, so what I like about this bag is that it is waterproof. Uh, the other thing that I like about it is that it's military issued, so it's uh, meant to... Uh, stick to those standards uh, that we need um, as far as it lasting and uh, lasting a while. So once again, I've had this one for uh, many years, okay? Uh, I'd say at least over 10 years. Uh, it wasn't my initial issue, but uh, it was another one that I picked up after the fact because I did like it. Uh, the other uh, great thing about this is it's inexpensive. I uh, found a company, and I'll put a link up on the uh, blog uh, on Amazon, that sells them for under eight bucks uh, shipped. All right, so you really can't beat that. Uh, one of the reasons I wanted to do this review is there's so much uh, high-speed stuff out there, so to speak, uh, that's expensive. All right, it works, but it's also pricey. Where here you go with something that's eight bucks that's uh, stood the, the test of time, so to speak, with the military. And, uh, you know, I could speak firsthand about that. And, uh, you know, once again, super inexpensive and does the job. Uh, uses that I have for this. Okay, while I'm out in the field, I always have my uh, Go Ruck with me, my GR1, and it fits... Uh, great in here. All right. Perfect fit. Even when it's loaded up more than it is now. So, um, uh, when I am trekking and, uh, want to keep it, uh, let's say keep my gear waterproof, I can go ahead and put it in the WP bag, you know, tie it up. And I know that I'm good to go. My gear is not going to get soaked. Uh, that would be on a trek. If I'm uh, camping and I'm in a tent and I want extra room in the tent, I want to be able to stage my gear outside. Once again, WP bag, my pack fits right in there. All right. So you've got plenty of room, uh, to, uh, to spare in here, uh, which is nice, all right? So uh, not only is it lightweight and could fold up because it's a bag, right? Right into your pack to carry with you just in case, but then it has these uh, multiple uses. The other one that I like is uh, 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 that I use it for a uh, bear bag, all right? Or even any kind of uh, critters, let's say, uh, raccoons, uh, things like that when we're out in the field, they're just annoying. You know, they come around and sniff the food, uh, especially in areas in Jersey where they're used to people because uh, there is, really isn't that much wilderness. So they're coming up on you while you're trying to sleep and shut off all your lights and things like that. So not only uh, do we have, let's say, bear country, right, with our black bears uh, that'll come and attack the food. So, you know, once again, fill this up. We know that it's waterproof. Uh, it has some consistency to it, all right? So it's, uh, you know, once again, the specs are good to go. It's not some little thing that's going to tear away uh, once you put some weight in there, like a Ziploc bag or something like that. And then we could hoist this up. Uh, into a tree and not have to worry about our food or uh, even being bothered uh, during our um, during our little uh, adventure, uh, whatever the whatever it may be. All right. So once again, it's waterproof, and I do have some uh, some gear in here. All right, some older uh, BDUs, uh, things of that nature. All right, I got these here. I got the uh, the ones from uh, training with the Portuguese Marines. All right, so stuff that I just have uh, backed up that I don't use on a daily basis, and I store. Uh, so once again, I figure I would throw these uh, in here. Uh, once again, I'll tie it up, and I'll give you a little bit of a test on its uh, waterproof ability. Okay, so I have my uh, trusty WP bag, waterproof bag, all tied up, and we're going to give it a, a little bit of a test in this uh, nice, nasty green uh, pool of mine. Now, keep in mind, I've uh, used this bag a lot, all right? I don't have any precious cargo in there. Uh, but uh, when you do get your bag, you might want to test it out, maybe fill it up with some water on the inside, see if there are any pinholes, things like that, uh, before you go ahead and uh, trust your uh, precious cargo, uh, so to speak, in your uh, waterproof bag. So we'll let that uh, sit there for a while. I'll uh, mix it around, uh, toss it around in there, and uh, leave it in there for a half hour or so just for the uh, purposes of this review. All right, guys, so I have my uh, two lifeguards, my Jack Russell and my Pitbull, uh, both trying to uh, save the life of the uh, WP bag. So it's been in there about a half hour. I flipped it around in uh, different positions. That's what made the uh, dogs all excited. They thought it was pool time and, uh, you know, time to play some, uh, some catch in the pool. But uh, unfortunately, that's not happening yet for a, uh, another couple months. Now, you see how it floats also, right? Another great benefit that you could use it as a uh, personal flotation device in a pinch in a survival situation. All right, just fill that up with there and uh, you're uh, pretty much good to go, at least getting some support in uh, any type of these situations, especially if you're trying to, you know, cross a, uh, a river or, you know, even a lake or anything with, uh, with any kind of a, of a current, you know, all these little things come into play and help and uh, make our life just easier. All right. And that's what we're kind of looking for.
All right, so we're going to get our WP bag out of the water. Been sitting in this nastiness for a while. All right, let me go ahead and open it up. Gonna need both hands here. Amazing, right? Not really, but <laughs> at the same time, that's pretty much what we expected or I wouldn't have uh, thrown all my gear in there. All right, so once again, something that's inexpensive, something that's super versatile, something that's light. All right, uh, if you think you have a uh, need for it in your uh, go bag, in your survival bag, uh, even just in any kit that you have uh, for multi-purposes, definitely picks uh, one of these WP bags up, all right, waterproof bags, because, uh, you know, you never know, could save your life one day. All right, Helder, thank you for viewing.